World Cup. Germany loses to Sweden. Big upset. United States, England semifinal. Netherlands, Sweden final. Championship for everything. All the marbles a week from today. Observation. I'm just glad I couldn't get down to the rivers in time to get a few shekels on Germany in that game, Rob, at the new sports book down there. Now, I, I, I'm being facetious. It would have been nothing that I would know anything about, but uh, it, it has. We talked last week. I wouldn't watch any of it, and now you got me hooked on the darn thing, and I'm watching these games, and they actually are pretty competitive and really intriguing. Tremendous young talent, these uh, young soccer players from around the world, and we both kind of said we had a little special place in our heart for France, the host country, who went down to defeat. We were kind of rooting for them a little bit. I was. I, I guess because they were the host country, and they, they've I don't know that France has ever really done much. Maybe in Men's World Cup they've, they've made some advances, but as a country they, they seem to always be the underdog in all of these events. It would have been interesting to see them, but I didn't certainly didn't want the United States. How about the other day in France it was 113 degrees. You know, I got to tell you. And they don't have air conditioning. Cool off. Well, they're just cool people. They drink wine, they relax. And by the way, to the Honorable President, Mr. McCrone, if you have two tickets for that match, uh, England and uh, USA, get a hold of us. Uh, Greg and I will go over and watch. Did they name those cookies after him? The, the no, it's Mac Room. No, oh. no, no. Hey, quickly, too, one more thing. The, the big trade. I've talked about it with everybody today. Shelby Gassessi, Josh Taylor, your observations, and we'll get back to the show. I think it was a had to do. You know, it was one of those things. His time was up. He was kind of had already checked out as a penguin. So uh, I think it's going to be a good thing for everybody. The guy they got was a number three overall pick a few years back. All right. Guess who's going to talk about that trade next? Stay tuned.